Hi, I'm Janet Fetter. This is a weird guitar lesson of a composition of mine called I Hear Voices. I'm going to show you how I set up my guitar to play the piece and I'm going to play the first little bit of it and then I'm going to swap guitars out and play the entire piece. If you have questions about anything you see on this, you're welcome to write to me directly. My email is brainbox, just like it sounds, brainbox at janetfetter.com. Okay, so one of the important features of this composition is this. It's a steel end, a ball end from a steel string, okay? So that's an important feature of this piece, and I'll show you how I use it. Typically, I keep one of those right here, just above the nut of my guitar, and um, then I just loosen the string and slide the steel, the little bead, you see that, the little bead right there. I slide it over the nut, and then I, and then I just tighten the string again, so I can, I don't have to unstring the string every time I use this. Now I'm going to take a split ring, and which you probably have your keys on, a larger version of that. I'm going to take that. I'm going to split it open a little bit like that with my thumb, and I'm going to put it behind the bead on my string. Here it's going to be per kind of perpendicular. It's not an exact science, but... And then, if luck is good, it's going to sound the way I want it to. It should be like this. I'm happy with that. Okay, so that's one thing that goes on. The other thing that goes on is a smaller version of that split ring. It's a lot smaller. And it's super fun to work with these on stage when there's lots of other things going on. Bright lights. It's really, really tiny, actually. It's that big. You can see that. I've split, the, I've split it open with my thumb a little bit, and then I'm going to force it onto the second string back here by the bridge. So the second string sounds like this. It's standard tune gu guitar, so it's B. And I'm going to put this, the closer I put it to the bridge, the closer it is to that pitch, to the B, but it's going to interrupt it a little bit and it's going to sound like this. So now I have this and this. One last thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to put this on the second string. This is an alligator clip. Oops, pocket size. And you've probably seen these. So I'm going to put it on my second string here, and it's going to bounce against the third string. It's going to rhythmically bounce against the third string. It's the full version of I Hear Voices. I'm playing a baritone guitar, so my low string, which is typically B, is dropped to B flat, half step down. My next string is E, then A, and then D, and then this string, F sharpish, and then this.
Thank you.